Hello everyone, welcome back and if you're new to my channel, welcome to Chicken Pops. My name is Hen and I like to play The Sims. Now most of the times on days like today I post build videos, but on other days I hop into Create a Sim, where I create tiny digital people that I've decided to be kinder to because, you know, yeeting them seems a little bit cruel to me lately. I don't know why, I don't know why. Um, anyway, how are you all doing? I hope you're all doing good because I know I'm good, so I hope you're good. Let me know in the comments how you are, okay? Okay, good. Um, anyway, so like I said, today again is another build video for me. Surprise, surprise, big shocker. Um, you know, nobody was expecting this. This has never been done before. But um, yeah, anyway, I decided to go back to the base game world um, and, you know, maybe start remodeling a few of the houses there. And so th this this is, you know, a a another, another one of the... Um, I think this is like the the cheap neighborhood um, in, in the base game. Um, I'm completely blanking on the name right now. Please don't judge me. It's <laughs> it's been a long day. <laughs> anyway, so I'm 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 kind of trying to edit this and, and just kind of keep my bearings and, and all of that. So I decided to to go with you know a, a very determined sort of black and white theme. Well, like starting out at least, but I did incorporate some color. Um, also completely changed the layout of the house because, you know, it, uh, buh, 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 English, good grief, um, how, how many seconds are we into this now? About a minute and 43 seconds now, and already messed up. <laughs> but anyway, the, the layout of the house, the floor plan, wasn't very good. Uh, there was only one bedroom and one bathroom, but there is enough space uh, in this house to kind of make it a little bit more family friendly. So this house is going to have a kids room and you know a, a main bedroom and then obviously a shared bathroom in the back um i, I think you guys saw that i kind of you know, changed the level bit. these windows are going to go um I, I wanted to use them but then uh, you know i thought that the horse ranch expansion pack windows would work better for you know the look that i sort of had in mind uh, for the house so yeah those are the ones that work. um so like i said i decided to go with like a decidedly black and white theme but um, I incorporated some color with like the, the living room rug. You'll, you'll see that later. Um, the living room rug and, you know, in, in, in the kids' room, I, I, I think I decided to make it a girl's room. So it's, it's got like, you know, pinks and, and light blues and all that. And then I, I did the same sort of color scheme with the main bedroom. The main bedroom also has like a, a few of you. Here I am adding a, a, a chimney stack to the house because, you know, the, the walls seemed kind of flat and boring and I thought it would just kind of add some interest. Uh, I'm constantly going with grey wallpaper. I need I need to change that. I need to change that. I know that's something that I need to work on. Grey gray wallpaper is starting to get a bit boring to me. Although I do like grey. It does make the, the, like, the use of it is very, very versatile. Also, again, the, uh, <laughs> the, the, uh, English. But the spa day tiles came to the rescue again for the front porch. Uh, I really like the, the, like the strong black color. I also like the way that the light sort of reflects off of it. Um, I think it looks really, really good. Okay, so here I'm starting to work on the living room. I went with the growing together fireplace because it is absolutely beautiful. It's one of my favorite fireplaces in the game. Um, after the parenthood uh, fireplace, I just, I like the classical shape. Um, I, I like the detail. It's just, it's, it's beautiful, okay? And then, obviously, Dream Home Decorator counters to the rescue. Once again, I went with plain white. Um, like I said, I went with a decidedly black and white theme. So, you know, plain white, very, 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 very basic. Um, it's, it's very clean looking. And then, you know, nice, comfy black couch. That's one of the most, you know, normal looking couches in the game to me. So I, I tend to use that one a lot in my own personal save file as well. And there we go, incorporating some color also wasn't sure whether I wanted to use uh, blinds or the, you know these go-to curtains that came that 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 was free to a lot of players. But you know um, I, I went with the curtains again. I, I I use them in every single every single build, honestly. And then the little side table. I think that came with tiny living. I might just size one down so that they're kind of like those. Um, I don't know what you call them, but like I'd, I'd call them like step. Or, or stacked um, side tables. They've got just a TV. I love that coffee table um, for the space. The, the color worked so well. I just, I, 
I don't use that coffee table too often, but I just, if it fit the space, it worked beautifully. I think I might use it more often. Go uh, adding in some, uh, some parchments, but it's not much more. For like the little breakfast here, and then obviously growing together the, uh, for the bookshelves. really put too much on them. I, I really kind of felt like this this house, because of like the style of the windows and the colour scheme and all that it had to be pretty minimal. And then also that way it won't, you know, pretty much over exert your game. Also it needs some rocking chairs for the front porch. Beautiful, stunning, amazing, never been done before. Um, use this idea for your own houses in real life. I'm a real game changer. <laughs> I'm not a real <laughs> I'm not a real game changer. Design. Like, I mean, who would have thought that I'd put uh, rocking chairs on the front porch? Okay, then we'll just, just add a couple of frames. I think we can start working on the bathroom next. Yeah, here we go. Also, growing together came to the rescue. Love that that uh, shower tub combo. Uh, basic watch. Ba -ba. English, again, Greek swatch. Uh, swatch. <laughs> basic white swatch. Really, really pretty. Very basic. Clean looking. Um, also, I'm. <laughs> The toilet paper on the, the toilet uh, thing, whatever whatever you call the back, not the toilet back. Um, also, the is a lot. And then I'm looking for my shelf. There we go, my typical bottom shelf that I always put in every hole. Just add some curtains. And then I think we're going to move to, yeah, here we go, to the girls' room. Deciding on a swatch here. I really liked the one at first. Um, wasn't really sure where to place the beds. But then I decided, you know, uh, putting two beds in the space might might be better for gameplay uh, in case you have more than one child, more than one, more than one girl, and uh, this little mirror there, I use that that, uh, that wall that mirror way too much as well, but I, I really like it. I kind of like the way that, you know, the colour of it breaks up the, the monotony of, you know, the mirrors that mix. But, so that's pretty much it. Um, for the space, yeah, we can also use that. Covered now with pink. Also, wasn't sure whether I wanted to. How my cat just dropped on my lap. Hi, Tim. <laughs> yeah, that, that that's it for, for the, 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 the English little girl's room. There we go. We went with blue tones for the main bedroom again. Also, wasn't too sure which bedside table I wanted to use, but I, I think I went with uh, yeah, growing together yet again to the rescue. The build bar items in that pack were so so strong. And then my favorite curtains again. Industrial lamps again. <laughs> I I think I'm becoming predictable at this point. I, I need to change up my game. So, yeah, I, th I think that's pretty much the entire build. Um, you'll see everything coming together in a second. I just I think I finished up you know, some landscaping at the end and added a fence to the outside and all of that. So it's it's pretty basic stuff. But yeah, the house is going to be up on my gallery. I'll try and upload it as soon as the video goes live. Uh, might might not happen. Maybe I'll maybe or something like that. Um, so, yeah. I think if you want, if you want to download it, um, my gallery ID is Chicken Pops Sims. It's the same as my Twitter handle. So, if you want to follow me on Twitter, um, you know, feel free to do so. Have a little conversation with me there. Um, if you don't have Twitter, you know, leave me a comment down below. If you have absolutely anything to say, um, have a conversation with me. Yeah. Okay, I try and respond to as many comments as I can. Like at the moment, I don't really have that many. <laughs> to be honest, but but yeah, you know I, I respond to to most comments. Um, what else? What else? Oh, if you haven't yet, please give the video a like. It really helps me out. Also tap the subscribe button if you haven't done so yet. That way you'll be a part of my little community here. I'll have screenshots up at the end. I see the video just stopped. I'll have screenshots up at the end. Um, they'll probably be on your screen right now, um, so that you know you you can maybe try and redesign this in your own house or in your own game. Good grief. Um, but yeah, that, that's it from me. I hope I get to see you next time. <laughs> okay, bye.